morning, Christina Brown here with the Brown Team at Remax. It is spring market. We're seeing it come. It's starting, so we're seeing listings pick up. If you want to sell your house this year, now is definitely the best time to list it. As always, things pick up already in March, so if you wait too long, you're going to miss the hottest time in the market. So we don't want you to do that. So in line with that, I have written down some interview questions that if you're thinking about selling your house, these are questions you should ask the agent that walks through your door. Obviously, if you're here in the Kansas City area, I'd love to be the person that you interview and I would be happy to answer all of these questions for you if I met with you. So these are just some suggestions again so that you know you are hiring the right agent. Not all agents are created equal. Not even all agents with the same company. Every single agent has a different work ethic, philosophy, marketing plan, if they have a plan, schedule, availability, experience. There's just so many different things that you must look at if you want to get the best agent for you. You need to get whoever lines up with the kind of service you need and you want. So let's just dive right in. The first question is, are you full time? That to me is a huge question because there are so many real estate agents, right? People that have gone to school, got their license, and they have zero experience or very little experience, or they have another job and they just do this part time. This market is insane, especially now more than ever, that you need to demand and require a full time agent. If they are not a full time agent, I would completely move on to someone else. So this business just does not stop. It is 24 seven constantly going. People are always online looking, reaching out, asking questions. And if they express interest, you want us to respond as your agent as quickly as possible while they are excited about your property. So that will quickly wear off and they'll quickly forget about it. If we don't do that, that really honestly takes a full-time agent. Somebody who is truly committed. The next question is, are you full service? What does that mean? So there are agents that will get paid a flat fee to do a few different things, either let's say paperwork, throw it in MLS, I can tell you, you get what you pay for. I recently had a seller from another agent tell that to me even because she got no help whatsoever. And honestly, if you're paying a flat fee, that agent does not care if it sells. They get paid the same no matter what. It's actually more work for them if it sells. So that's something you should definitely think about, which leads me into my next question you should always ask. How much do you charge? So we want to know that if we are buying a car or a house, well guess what? If you're listing a house utilizing their services, you need to know that. So that agent needs to tell you. How long have you been in the business? That's a great question because do you have somebody with very little experience or with a whole lot of experience? Again, this market is moving so fast, it's completely crazy. There's so many different variables that come in on offers once they're received. We're seeing sellers get stacks of offers. How in the world do you weed through it and know that you're making the best decision? And how do you qualify those buyers to know who's going to be the buyer that will get it all the way to the closing table? Those are things that an experienced agent who has really been through this many times will know. Another great question is, do you have experience in my area or neighborhood? So if you get an agent that's driving two hours away to help you, probably not a good idea. I highly doubt they drive two hours every day to constantly be there and be in the know and be in the area and to really truly know what's happening in your area. So really make sure you get somebody that knows the area that has experience in the area. That is super important and very crucial. The next question is a great question if you're looking to sell and that's how would you market my property? Every property is different. You should, as an agent, right, market properties different depending on the kind of buyer you're looking for, the kind of property it is. Listing a horse property is looking for a whole different clientele that are looking in different areas than let's say somebody looking at a downtown loft 
and everything in between. So make sure that they have a really good marketing plan for you that makes sense for your property. That's very, very important. Another one is, do you have references? Who have you worked with? Do you have anybody that has anything good to say about you? That's really, really important because your clients are going to speak louder for you and your experience than you should for yourself. So references, reviews, those are all crucial and important in checking out on agents. I always, even when I go to a listing appointment, I always say, when I sit down with that person, have you done any research on me? If you haven't, I highly suggest you Google me or whoever else that you are talking to. That is crucial. Always Google who you're talking to. And my last question is, do you offer a cancellation policy? That is important because what happens if the relationship just doesn't work out or you feel that the agent you choose fails on their duties or they are just not responding to you or you know you're just not getting the service that you need I always do a cancellation guarantee I always recommend that you go with an agent that will that's not going to charge you a fee make sure you know what their cancellation policy is and that they will allow you to do it without charging you an exorbitant fee because they know if they charge you a fee you're not going to cancel and you'll be stuck with their terrible service so something to think about those are some great questions i hope they help you if you're wanting to sell give me a call give me a chance and i would absolutely answer all of these questions for you have a great day